Oh, okay. Hello. Okay. My mic is on this time. That never happens for me. <laughs> and then today it is the capture card. Where's the settings? Oops. No, that didn't do it. One second. That do it? Yeah, nice. I'm learning. <laughs> okay, you guys should be able to hear audio now. Cool. I got money for selling all the flowers. Oh my gosh. I forgot I helped Gulliver yesterday or the day before. And I'm really, 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 really hoping that this is finally the lucky cat. Oh, please, please, please. The number of times it's been like pirate stuff. Oh no. Can you guys hear this okay? Or is it just like quiet? No? This one more time. Is that any better or no? Can't tell if it's coming through or not. the joys of not knowing what I'm doing. Lost in the sauce. Okay. OBS situation. So many buttons. Oh, okay. Cool. Hello, situate. Sir Yeet. Thank you, friends. Welcome. I'm very sad that I did not get the lucky cat today. I got a sphinx. What am I supposed to do with a sphinx? It doesn't even have a nose. Can you put stuff on top of it? No. Sad. Maybe next time it'll be the lucky cat. <sighs> I will wait. Have been waiting. Continue to wait. Hmm. <laughs> 
I could. I could make a temple devoted to the lucky cat, but in order to do that, I need to have a lucky cat. And I've been trying for like three years to get a lucky cat and still don't have one. Oh, I love that she's using this little area <laughs> to read her book. That's so cute. I feel bad for bothering her now. <laughs> oh, waiting lucky cat. She looks so cute with her little book and my little, like, gnome garden. I love that. I'm gonna take this weed. Because it's yellow. Okay. Ugh, oh, I hate these. Before we get to the fun part, I have to do a bunch of maintenance, and by maintenance I mean pulling all of these little weeds that are yellow. Stand them. Um, so today, I'm thinking that I'm going to decorate this part of my island and get rid of that yellow weed. Um, I thought about it, and I don't know, I feel like a cool like island bar situation could be really fun here. I just have to collect some items and start placing them.
feel like I have so many duplicates of items. Um, Thank you. <laughs>
comrade KK. I have really big pockets, yes. I can hold a lot of stuff. Very helpful, especially when trying to do stuff like this. Oh, what is this? Do I have one of these? No. I don't really want to use one. There you go. Oh yeah, there it is. Okay. So... Maybe three of those. Don't really want to wait till tomorrow, so I might jump forward to grab those items faster. Counters. And then, no. I hate when that happens. I will replace these. And the new ones come in. Um, also, don't like the way that looks. Okay. Pockets are full. Don't have a choice. Wait. How can I go? Oh, I just realized the ground is finally like green again. So nice. I was really tired of like the brown grass. Hello, Angelo, welcome. Ex Angelo, or do you go by Angelo? I am doing island design today. Just have to make room in my pockets first. Thanks for the follow. That's really nice of you. Thank you. 
I'm just gonna leave these items here until the stuff I ordered to replace it comes. Um, what else was over here? I think that was it. Oh, it was the food. I had, oops. I feel like ants will come. Mm. If I can like set it on this chair. Perfect. Okay. Angelo, do you play Animal Crossing? Just like to watch people play it. this little section of my island feel more like full. Um, I think I mentioned this on a different stream, but I used to have um, my campsite over here. put like a uh, palm tree back here but I have mixed feelings about palm trees that are not on the beach even though I'm almost certain I have one somewhere What do I do? Um, oh, hi, Fred. Sorry, totally missed you. Um, welcome. I play Animal Crossing and a lot of other games, but I decided I wanted to play a chill game today, so Animal Crossing was the first choice. 
What do you do? Zebo. <laughs> I didn't think that part out. Hold on. Aww. See you at. What does that mean? See you at. Thanks for the follow. I'm still not sure what see you at means. Hydrate. It is important. Always, always stay hydrated. <laughs> it's still too close. That is... Okay. 
just one sec. Sorry about that. My dog wanted to come in, um, so I had to open the door really quick. should have done before I did all of this work I should have put like deck down Trying to decide if it looks dumb on the grass or not. I feel like it does. Oh, hey. I'm gonna call you Kato. <laughs> I'm not saying <laughs> the first half. Welcome. Oh, that's okay. <laughs> Do you play Animal Crossing?
You like www. What is that? I don't know what that is. Okay. I really thought I would like the sand like this, but I don't think I do. Mm. It just looks weird with the grass outline. because I want it to be like a bigger beach area but with the grass it's just sworn let's see yes the palm tree lamp okay I know that it exists where did I put mine do I have one or do you have to make it
Okay, that looked a lot lamer than I thought it would. They just look like little grapes. No. No. Not for me. gone back and forth on this so many times, the number of times I've placed those items and then I them back up is ridiculous. Okay. This tile is staying, for sure, if I like it or not. I'm done. <laughs> I don't hate that. We're getting somewhere. Progress.
little corner piece is gonna drive me nuts. I cannot wait to get a new chair. So soon. It's gonna be so much more comfy. I'm hoping to get one like next week, maybe. We'll see. I think I just like don't wanna go try out chairs. That just sounds like a pain. You guys have any good chair recommendations? Let me know. This is coming along pretty nicely. Um, hmm. Okay, 
Okay, let's see. What else do we have in storage? Chairs would be nice. I need like a lot more than two. And then if I can customize those. Hmm. I feel like at one point I had this funny looking like shower thing, like a daisy shower head. I don't know. It looks like this lamp, but it's not the lamp. It's a shower. Uh. Hmm. Nope. Oh, it's on my mic. Um. Trying to look and see. some stuff to put on the counters or like bar top. I love these little paint cans. I have yet to find a good use for them, but I think they're super cute. Um, I don't like any of these drinks. Do I have like recipes? There has to be a more user-friendly way to have this like shopping app. I'm looking for like drinks to go on the bar top. I have the fruit, the fruit drinks, but I don't really like the glasses that they come in. So I'm hoping maybe see something like this, but not this, <laughs> like that shape, not that color. Um, nope. A milkshake. It's getting closer. Strawberry soda. I feel like that's as close as I'm gonna get. I don't know. I already have a bunch of those, I think. Mm, yeah, no. Okay. Another question.
a lot of hours in this game, but I feel like the majority of those hours are s scrolling through these crazy long inventories and item lists. enough room, but I'm still gonna try. Oh, okay. Nice. I really did not think that was gonna fit there, but I will take it. Great. Now we have those. We need the bar stuff, and then... I also feel like I have some kind of, like, fruit punch, like, dispenser seen it maybe it's like that the um paradise planning part i think we're gonna go on a trip good timing i have her lost item so i can return that now oh wow the irony cap. I've always wanted one of those. Not really. I feel like they give the worst, <laughs> the worst clothing item gifts. I feel like it's very rare that I'm like, ooh, this is something I really wanted. Um, yeah, I think I'm gonna go to Paradise Planning and see if I can order more stuff. Rooster. I'm <laughs> 
Ah, my favorite. Another list. Actually, like, where would it be? Blood orange juice. See, that's what I'm talking about. Something that, like, looks. Okay, we have blood orange juice and then I really want, oh my gosh, cans. These would be so cute for my little grocery store. I think I'm going to do the fruits and veggies. sounds. Juice dispenser or punch something. The mixer's cute. I think I have enough of those though. Uh, so many items. and everyone else. Um, I'm gonna try and look it up. Punch jar. No. Juice jar. Yes. Okay, infused water dispenser. I know that this exists. Where do I get it? Is it a DIY? Oh my gosh, if it's a DIY. No, 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 please don't be a DIY. I guess that makes it easier to make. Ugh, I just want to make this gold cat so bad. This is why I'm so determined to get the lucky cat. It's gonna happen for me someday, I promise. Um, 
I know that I've like seen it before. Oh, Angel Girl, thanks for the follow. Welcome. I am currently searching for an infused water dispenser for an island bar I'm trying to build and it's, um, wait, it's not here. It's so annoying. It would be like right here. Dang. Okay. <sighs> Rip. Someday I will find it and it'll be fine. I must have like placed it in a house while doing the paradise planning because I know that I've like had one before. I'm just gonna check Nook's stuff one more time. I guess a mixer will do in its place. I'll go back. Is it? Thank you. Okay, so. I'm so glad you stopped by. <laughs> Once I get to the other side, I'm gonna look a little closer because I was looking and it. I looked online to try to find it. Required materials. Is it like a. Okay. Now, now it's personal. Am I just like too impatient to like. I guess I, I don't have it unless it's like in this section, which I don't think it is. No. Oh, I have the stuff to make the little raccoon. Well, that's a bummer. Till then, a mixer it will be. They just look so cute and refreshing. I wonder, actually, maybe I know someone who has one. Hold on. Phoning a friend. Okay, friend has been phoned. Check back tomorrow to see if friend has infused <laughs> water dispenser. Um, but thank you for the shout um, that it is a angel girl. I believe you live up to your name. And if you could make give me a lucky cat. <laughs> See, okay, I have mixed feelings now. I'm like, yes, I'll take your lucky cat. But then there's also this like personal pride where I'm like, I want to get it myself. <sighs> I'll think about it. I want a lucky cat so bad. It's so, <laughs> it's so dumb. I've had this gold lucky cat recipe for like two years 
and I help Gulliver every, is that how you got it? Or did you get it through um, like paradise planning? I think if you help like Petrie, you can get the, the cat. Maybe you have like a chance of getting it through um, paradise planning, but I've heard you have to get it through Gulliver. So I help Gulliver every single time he's on my island and it's always stupid pirate stuff or a sphinx. I got a sphinx today from Gulliver. I envy you. <laughs> um, that's awesome. I'm so, so jealous. I want one so, so bad. Now I'm looking for a mixer. Gotta stay on task, okay. Mixer. Oh, there they are, okay. This will do for now. Just a little placeholder and then, since I believe you arrived after I was out of this area, this is what I'm working on today. Just making like a cute little area, it was super bare. Um, there's like nothing here. I used to have my campsite here, but I recently moved it to the other side of my island. Um, and this little pedestal right here next to the um, mixers uh, is where I want to put the infused water dis dispenser. Um, when that happens for me. But for now, a mixer. It just doesn't look right. I feel like the fruit would really make it. Um, can I order those drinks? I have chairs, two chairs, I need more chairs. I don't love that they have a black base. I will probably edit those to be white at some point, but for now, I'm just gonna leave them as is. I can't believe you have two lucky cats. I don't think I'm gonna get over that. <laughs> so we can't place them too close together or we can't really. Into the ocean with the lamp. Okay. I kind of like that for now. It works. And then maybe like some seafood dishes or something to go on the tables.
Treasure Island. What does that mean? Go to Treasure Island. I've been to Scorpion Island. I made it there once. It took me an entire day and an insane number of tickets. But I've never been to a Treasure Island. Explain. I really want to go to Tarantula Island next. Um, cause that I want like the little uh, what's it called? The um, little like, oh my gosh, the model, the little artwork that uh, Flick makes, uh, where you have to submit three of them. But I just I don't know. I never see tarantulas. I feel like I always find scorpions, but. Maybe I just don't play late enough when the uh, scorpions or tarantulas are out. kind of cute if someone was actually sitting there. Do I like it that way? Mm. Food with eyes kind of freaks me out, I'm not gonna lie. I I often will refuse to eat food that has eyes. That's really cool. Thanks for telling me that. Um, I don't know. I think I want to find... <laughs> of all the things to be particular about, I think I, I think I want to like get the lucky cat on my own. Because I've been like hunting it for so long now. I think, I don't know, I would just, I think I'd be disappointed in myself or something <laughs> if I like got it another way. But that is really cool to know that like they, people do treasure islands or giveaways and things. Play any other games besides Animal Crossing?
Okay, I feel like this is kind of coming along. Um, once the, like, drinks are placed, I need to order more chairs. That's a must. like kick myself when I order stuff in the wrong color and then I take it to Cyrus and have him redo all of it for me so I'm trying to be better about going and like getting that color option and then ordering things because otherwise you're just double put paying <clears throat> oh Pokemon Cafe that's interesting Stardew Valley okay I so I own Stardew Valley and I just I don't know. I don't know why I can't get into it. Maybe I needed to give it another try. It felt like... Maybe it's because I was playing on like a small screen. If I was playing on my PC, maybe I like would like it more because it'd be like on a bigger screen. The pixels, it was very small on my Switch and my Steam Deck. Um, But now, now I have a monitor I can play on, so... I might give it another try. Luigi Mansion sounds fun though. I feel like sometimes when I start talking, I forget what I was doing. <laughs> and I have to like really read and be like, where was I gonna go again? I'm going to Harf's Island. I also always have my island designer on when I go to fly. Poor Orville is probably sick of me. These are all great. You know, one game I actually started playing recently that... I don't know. It's it's an interesting one. It's probably not for everyone. Um, but I think it's... I like the game style. And it, it kind of does not remind me of Animal Crossing in any way outside of like maybe kind of the art style um but I really like Cult of the Lamb um it's a fun game you're like a little lamb 
who runs a cult. And I don't know. It's it's a fun game. I like it. <laughs> it, I, it, it comes and goes in waves. Like sometimes I like it and then other times I get frustrated and I don't really want to play it. Today is one of those days where I didn't feel like playing it. Um, I'm trying to think what others. I like Witchwood too. That's a good one. Um, I don't know. I'm trying to get like outside of Animal Crossing. I've I've played Animal Crossing pretty exclusively for like the past few years, like since it came out. Um, and so I've been trying to do things outside of that. It's, I don't know, it's hard. I, I enjoy this game so much that like, I don't really ever want to play anything else. Um, this weekend though, I was thinking about maybe doing like a full playthrough of, uh, what's it called? Oh, um, Haven Park. It's kind of like a short hike, but different. Um, I bought that game like a while ago and I don't know, it's a, it's a cute little like game. You're a little bird, you run around and you set up campsites on an island. I have to get new controllers. I'm buying new controllers this weekend. <laughs> I feel like this happens every time I stream and I'm so tired of it. Um, but yeah, if you guys have any games that you're interested in like seeing someone play through, I'm interested because I need different games that are not Animal Crossing. Animal Crossing is very much my comfort zone. Um, what was the other game I bought? Oh, uh, I bought another game on, uh, Steam called Vegan Vampire. I haven't, I haven't gotten it to work quite yet. There's a couple bugs that are, st it's still in beta testing, I think. Like, it's not fully out. I could be wrong. Don't quote me on that. Um, but their developers should get back to me and I'm hoping that I can get that up and running. So I can try it out this weekend as well. Um, trying to think if there's any others. Someone asked me to play Elden Ring and Dark Souls yesterday. I don't know. I'm thinking about it. I make no promises because I just, I don't know. It's just not, <laughs> it, would, it would be for the meme if I played it. It would be funny um, because I think I would just rage quit every, five minutes um, based on my understanding of how those games work. So yeah, I don't know. I'm curious um, what other games people are playing. Okay. Hmm. I feel like this looks, it's like, working for me. Maybe some flowers. I feel like flowers might make this look nicer. And since you guys haven't seen much of my island, I've kind of been like focused on this section. I'll take a different route so you can see a little bit more. Um, I like putting all of my islanders like on the beach because in my opinion, why would you live on an island if you don't live on the, like on the beach? Um, so I have a little greenhouse area over here that I've run by probably like six times since you joined the stream. Um, and there's a farm behind it where I keep all of my plants. Um, this is Audie's house. I like putting little stools outside of their homes so that when I get their picture, I have like a little spot to put them. They always, they always do this when I'm in the middle of something. Sorry, buddy, I'm not doing that right now. Don't mind my dog in the background. I think he just like woke up and hit the door. Um, but yeah, I like putting my islanders on the beach. I think it's cute. Um, I like this little like gnome garden. I like adding these little like skeletons around my island. I just think they're funny. Um, I have a little grocery store that I put in the other day. I think it's kind of cute. It was a very quick build. I just grabbed a bunch of stuff out of my inventory and then ordered a few things and now we have a grocery store. Um, and then I don't really know why that pillar's there, but it's vibin'. <laughs> exactly. 
Um, you get it. Yeah. Some people are weird about putting islanders on the beach. And I don't, I don't get it. Um, I think, I don't know. It's, it's like nice. I don't put all of my islanders on the beach, but I like putting most of them on the beach. I think it just makes sense. Um, I have, so I pulled all of the counters out of this space. So all my stuff's on the ground. But this is supposed to be like a seafood kitchen. Um, I ordered new counters and those will get here tomorrow. So I'll put those back and it'll look nice again. But I really wanted to build that beach bar in the back. So I was like, I'm just going to take these. Um, this is my like little fishing shop, fishing tackle shop is what I'll call it, I guess. Um, I also love these little raccoons. I think they're hilarious. I like their little belly buttons. I think they're just funny little chubby raccoons and they make me happy. Um, and then I have like a little garden here. That's Fing's house. Kitty lives over there. I'm also obsessed with this like moss tiling, whatever you want to call it pattern I found. Um, just like searching around and I think it's super cute. I have a little coffee shop that took forever to install. I had to bother Brewster a lot to get all these little pieces from him. He actually gave me this coffee plant on Tuesday this week. I was really excited to get that from him. I had like a feeling when I went in, I was like, I feel like he's gonna give me something today. And he did, and it was a coffee plant. Um, so that was cool. And then um, I have an ice cream shop and a little fast food truck. Fast food, it's just a food truck. Um, I'm trying to put in a bakery next to Able Sisters, but I don't like this neighbor and uh, I'm being stubborn and I won't move the neighbor until the neighbor leaves. And so I'm just trying to get to this neighborhood, neighbor. Um, and then I'm putting in a little orchard back here because I also realized on Tuesday that I didn't have any fruit trees on my island. Somehow, when I redid it for the fourth time, I accidentally cut down all of my trees. Um, but I had fruit in my inventory, so I'm growing them all back. And then to the main event, because I've redone my island so many times, I have a ton of flowers and I have a rainbow of flowers in the back. So I like coming back here when I'm redoing sections of my island so I can like pick what I want to plant where. It kind of gives me like a good idea of what looks good together. Um, and I can see it like all in one place and just kind of grab whatever I'm feeling that day. Um, it would be helpful if I had like um, the little like bush plants that you get uh, from leaf but I don't have those back here right now. Hmm. So I will settle for mums. These like little daisy looking things. Okay. So that's that section of the island. I'm also working on this area. Um, I have like a little pumpkin patch that's still in the works and then this is where I moved my campsite. So like I mentioned earlier, um, the area I'm working on today is where my campsite used to be. Um, so I'm trying to like fill this space in a little bit more and create some separation from the area behind it. Um, is that DIY oh, I love vines and moss. <laughs> Wait, what is the Celeste flower garden? Okay, now I have questions. I have to look that up like right now. I'm so curious. I use Pinterest as well. I think it's a really good place to get like ideas. Um, it gives me like vision for what I want and then I'm kind of able to make it my own. I'm so curious. Okay, well, um, if you look up Celeste Flower Garden without Animal Crossing, really pretty pictures come up, but... <gasps> a 
That is incredible. That's amazing. So for her eyes, um, wow. I just like need a moment to like take it in. That's so cool. Um, I feel like this took so long and probably took, wow. Okay, sorry, sidetracked. I just got distracted. Um, for her eyes, the picture I'm looking at is on obviously Reddit and it looks like they have like a like a star patterned like tile that they put down. I'm curious what you did for yours. Is yours also the like star tile or did you do something else? And then they have like little um, stars placed on top of the star tiles. Super, super cute. I've never seen this. amazing oh so it's a those so it's a DIY recipe that makes her eyes I feel like I'm getting schooled in Animal Crossing right now okay sidebar I just found super, super cute. Is this essential oil diffusers? Oh, the Nova light. Okay, got it. I thought they just placed the stars because they look the same to me. That's really cool. Do I like, have that recipe? I don't even know. I've been really bad about like chatting with Celeste and like catching her on the island. Not my proudest um, thing because I do love Celeste and I love the recipes she gives. Um, yeah, I don't think I have that one. These are the recipes I have from her. Someday, someday I will catch up to everyone else. <laughs> blue table okay well I found this reddit post you might be interested in um, it looks really cool it's like a um, it looks like someone went and downloaded like a someone's design code and it's like stars um, trying to figure out how I can here actually I'll just drop it in chat that makes it easier check this out that's what I'm looking at and it looks really cool. I really like the eyes. So it's my two cents for your Celeste face. Let me know what you think, I'm curious. And also tell me if those are the Nova lights because I really feel like that is like stars someone found on their beach and we're like, I'm gonna place this in, in my flower garden. Oh, and then I was also going to, before I got sidetracked by this like gorgeous arrangement of flowers on the side, um, this is where I keep my museum. It's still, still kind of in the works. I like it. I use, this is where I put my vines. It's the same, but those are just stars. Okay, cool. My eyes are not failing me. Good to know. Awesome. That makes me feel better. I was like, I, I feel like, I feel like I would know the difference. Um... But yeah, this is where I keep my museum. Funny story. So this 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 little skeleton in particular, um, that spot, like when I was making this like waterfall formation and stuff, the number of times I got stuck there because I would accidentally jump over a waterfall and then I couldn't get out. It it happened so many times that I finally decided I'm placing a skull here so that I can't jump over and to honor the number of times that I 
had to call for help or aka in my eyes it's kind of like dying but you can't die in animal crossing you just like pass out because you got bit by a scorpion or a tarantula or you get rescued by the dodos and i've been rescued so many times by the dodos from that spot so that's why that little mossy skeleton is there because it happened a lot like too many times to count. I don't know how many times it happened. Anywho, back to the beach. Let's see if it'll let me hop over. We're back. Oh yeah, I was um, gonna plant flowers. I'm telling you, when I start talking, I forget. I'm like, what What was I doing again? Why, why did I do a tour of the island? What, what caused me to lose the plot? Now I remember. Oh no, I forgot I had low battery. I think I'm probably going to wrap up stream here in like the next 10-ish minutes. Um, just to like let my controllers charge for a bit but I might get back on later it's really late I might not I don't know I'll definitely be on this weekend um I'm thinking like Saturday probably Friday night late on Saturday I have a dinner with some friends and then maybe Sunday but if you guys are interested in a playthrough of Haven Park, let me know. Cause that's kind of what I'm thinking. I think it'd be fun to just like play straight through. Like I, I think the last time I looked, I think it said it takes like seven to eight hours. I will have to get extra controllers, <laughs> but um, I don't know. I think it could be fun. If it's something you're interested in, let me know. Or we can just play Animal Crossing all weekend. That's an option too. Actually, no, I really don't want to play Animal Crossing all weekend. I really am trying to like play other games, like sometimes at least. I'll probably play some. If I'm being truly honest with myself. Um, but yeah. I don't know. I feel like this, this this looks right to me. It's coming along. I think once the little drinks arrive, it'll be better. And then I wanna figure out something to do like back here. I don't know quite yet. TBD. I just feel like I have to take my island in such small sections and I get frustrated when it looks like super open and like unfilled, I'm just like, failed but it's gonna get there I just have to be like patient um, and then I also um, I wanted to see if I had anything I could add over where Someone just woke up from a nap. Are you good? He has his feet like up against the door. I don't know if you can see, he's making like a terrified face. Just gonna. You good, buddy? Hard. It's hard to be a husky. Sleep all day. Snack all afternoon howl all morning an exhausting life he leads that is probably my cue to take him outside though so i'm glad i'm going to wrap up here in a few um hmm 
Oh, this. I have been meaning to place this for like a minute. So we're going to pull that now. Kind of like the yellow. Mm. Oh, this is what I got from Gulliver today. A Sphinx. In insanely disappointing. Um, it's going to happen for me. I'm like willing it into existence. I'm just going to keep helping Gulliver and... When the time is right, I will get my lucky cat and then I will be able to use the DIY recipe that I've had for like two years and I will finally get my golden lucky cat. It'll be great. And it's going in the very front of my island and it's going to, I'm excited. I'm going to just like make a whole like altar for my lucky cat. Um... I always want to place these like sand castles, but I just don't like the way they look personally. They just like don't really do it for me. Um, a generator could be cool. Maybe a little cart. There's some more skeletons, creepy skeletons. Um, okay, that's good for now. And yeah, I'm gonna go place these items and then I'm gonna show you one or two Easter eggs on my island that I didn't point out the first time I was running around. Um, but they'll be quick, so. Okay. Also, I don't know if anyone has noticed, but the price for this, this fire pit, it's like $98,000 in Nook's store and it makes no sense to me. It's just like one of those weirdly expensive items. I remember the first time I was looking for it, I think I had accidentally sold it back to Nook. This is gonna drive me crazy. So I was having to buy it back and I was like, it's $98,000. I think, I don't even know how much I got selling it back, but I was, I was shook. And this is gonna drive me nuts that these don't line up. Good enough? That That's fine. It's not fine. Oh! Right now? Oh, I thought you meant you were like streaming right now. And I was like, oh my gosh, show me. <laughs> I want to look at your island. but I've always really liked placing the outdoor generator like by my campsite. I feel like it's like nice for people who are like here camping. Oh, that's okay. Yeah. And like a little utility wagon maybe. Okay, question. For those of you who do play Animal Crossing pretty religiously, do you find yourself like kind of playing Animal Crossing in real life sometimes? Like, I feel like on the weekends and stuff sometimes, like I find myself like rearranging all my furniture and like, I don't know, I get like hyper fixated like I do in the game and like making everything like look nice and I don't know. Maybe that's just my OCD talking, I don't know. Just me, that's okay. <laughs> uh, 
Um, okay, so I've got those things placed. So there's two quick Easter eggs I wanted to share because I think they're funny. And I hope you think they're funny. If not, I'm sorry, my jokes suck. Um, okay, number one. One of my favorite little design codes that I have is this like Spongebob and Patrick tile I have here. It's the only one on my island. It takes up a whole design slot in my whatever, but it's worth it because every time I run by Spongebob and Patrick, I laugh. Um, I just think it's super cute. It reminds me of like the Spongebob movie. There's that. And then, last but not least, I have my like little alien lookout, and it makes me very happy. So, if you like run over here and you like. And he like beams down and then when you're like standing down here, he'll like beam back up. <laughs> yeah, I don't know. I like the spaceship. It's a... It took me a long time to figure out what I was going to do with it. I knew I wanted to keep it because I liked the little alien guy that would come down. Um, but yeah, that's my island today. Um, I think I'm going to wrap up for the evening. I was considering getting back on later, but I just don't think I can do it. Um, but I will be on tomorrow night, um, most likely very late on Saturday, depending on what happens at dinner, <laughs> make half promises, I guess here. Um, and then, yeah, I think, I think I'm going to do a playthrough of Haven Park this weekend, like the whole way through. I would like to do it in like one session, maybe, but that might be biting off too much. Um, I don't know, we'll see, it'll be a good weekend. Um, I hope everyone has a good night and a good start to their weekend tomorrow. Um, I'm sure we'll chat soon and that's it for me.